Hey guys, VJR Car Reviews here. Today I'm gonna review this Toyota Tamaro FX or the little brother the Toyota Revel. I already reviewed the little brother of this car. So if you want to watch that review, click the top right hand corner of this video. So this is a low power car and actually this is the first AUV of Toyota. I mean among the AUVs, this is the top the top one the, the first the very first AUV in Toyota. Let's get started. So this one are I think it's our hmm. Hmm. Goodyear. What are these? Goodyear wait. This is Goodyear Wrangler DT tires, I think so. There's a black side mirror, this is manual. And the, I check out the trunk. Now the pickup is on the right. Use the key to open it. Here we go. Here's the back. There's a trunk release only. Now, here's what they look to inside. So, here's the inside of these. Now, these are ma these have third rows. Like, also the Toyota Revo. Some of the summers can also be found at the little brother of this one. It are the handles. So. This can f this now if y if the third row of your car is like this, it's on the side. So to fold the seats, you don't need to fold like that, like a regular SUV, like like an SUV, like the Chevrolet Blazer, Toyota Highlander, Mitsubishi Outlander, Mitsubishi Motor Sport. You're gonna do a ma now to fold the seats. It's magic seats. Those are like the Honda HRV, Honda Jazz, or Fit. And uh, some pickup trucks. Now this one actually, after you fold this seat, you pull this bars down, but the bars are actually broken. Now, like the Chrysler Town Country and the little brother of this car, the, the third the third row windows can also be can also be actually can also be open to ex get some extra air. Try right, this, and also this one. There you go. It's really nice. Actually, let's just go down here and see those. Really nice. Look at how they are. Very nice. And also this one. Let's just get in here and then. Fuck them. Now the actually the the interior trunk release on the Toyota Tamaro Tamaro FX and Toyota Revo are different. The Toyota Revo setup, but this one's the original. But the rest of the interior doors is also the same the Toyota Revo or the little brother. I think this is pro white. And then you have the show your pickup release there. This is actually, I mean, we know I love motorcycles. More, more, more so here we go. Here's the inside of this. Now the horn is on the side. And this one doesn't have any tachometer, not like the second gen Tamaro FX. But this is only a speedometer. Now, actually. Here's the wiper switches, lighting turn signals, and high beam switches. Here's your Pioneer audio system. This is already repaired. Actually, yes. And you have your simple scan control, recycling, fan, sp recycling, fan speed, different almost from defrost. And you have your kind of controls up there. And actually, the, the, the Toyota Tamaro FX and Toyota Revo has a Actually, a rear, rear can control it, the other AUVs, but this one doesn't have any. Actually, I think this does. I think it's already original. No, have don't have actually rear, rear can control. It is five-speed manual, pedals and clutch, standard and manual transmission. Cars only your speak uses only a speaker. Full storage, hood release, manual windows. Hard. I think I'll just remain that open. Just remain that. Remain that open. 
are actually your seats. Oh, this is a bench seat. Looks like the Nissan NV350 Irvine. Now, oh, here's your e breaker It's on the right there, actually. It's just also like the, my, the old Mazda BT50, the first gen. Okay. Now, both gen Mazda BT50s were actually were bought of ours. Now, it's really nice also. So to, so to, re, so to deactivate, press this button and turn it. And to deactivate, just turn it. And then go like that. Then press also the button and then go to turn it. Here's your fuel gauge and water gauge. Here's your glove box. It won't open. Hmm. It won't open. The bridge is up there also. Here's your center rear mirror. Now this one doesn't have any airbag rules and no gear. Mirrors and here are and you have one grip handle on in the right front right that means to be see a mirage there it is this is a teak speaker i think i think there are six speakers i think so what now let's have the locks up there lock that and then let's go to the back let's go over here Now, this is actually manual locks also guys, so here we go, the manual, manual windows, the rear, it's really nice also, and extra air also, here's your seat belt, manual belt adjustable, here's your rear, in, rear interior illumination, the door, um, now here, young people still high leg room and and high headroom. This is quite very nice here. So that's it on my review. And please subscribe BJR Car Reviews on YouTube. By the way guys, when you're gonna wait now example you're going to the mall and then you finish parking in the basement parking and then you want to close the rear, rear lock, so now the, the, my dad taught me a button, actually, I already know how to do it, so there. There are four ways, first, first step, open the rear, when you're going to lock the rear doors, when you're in park, when you're going to the mall, and you're parking on the basement parking. First step, open the rear rear windows. Second, open the rear door. Side steps are in for individual, see? And then third, just lock that. And then four, and then the last step is to close. So close, actually. Hard. It's hard. There you go. So that's it. So please subscribe VJR Car Reviews in YouTube. Please watch, like, and subscribe when I don't want you to miss anything by reviews, car reviews and teach, liking videos, and subscribing VJR Car Reviews helps VJR Car Reviews grow. Thank you and goodbye. Oh, by the way, one machine food in the wipers up there.